staying at the Richmond. So this is the best spot if you are in Mega World. Look at that. It's right there, right beside the Festivalk Mall. So this is the best location. We wanted to give you a good idea where to stay. Look at the lobby, isn't this beautiful? restaurant over here too honey greenery look at this wow you don't like cakes and donuts I'm so hungry <laughs> suddenly I'm starving suddenly all right we got our room card now we're gonna go upstairs and check out our room it's it's pretty sweet get ready for this it's a nice one Come, oh. come look at the wow. pool. Oh, and you can see the pool. There's someone doing laps. <laughs> oh, we're looking forward to that. But yeah, there you go. If you're talking about like proximity to Mega World, guys. You could spit at it. Don't, please don't do but that. But don't do that, because that would be bad. Or so on pool, I don't know. Okay, look at, wait, wait, wait. So this, look at the room key. It's made out of wood. That is so cool. Don't use it as a throwing star, though. All right, we're going to 1004. Can you tell me where 1004 is? Can you say Sorry. Diego? Welcome. Oh, oh, turn some lights on. Welcome. Here I come. What? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Don't show it all yet. These are cold. What? Why is it so cold? I love it. What? All right, all right, let's do the room tour. Let's okay. Let's do it, wait, a bathroom. A guest bathroom, look at that. You wanna be our guest? You're gonna have this bathroom. Okay, you cannot use any other bathroom. Yeah, because there's two ba bathrooms in this room. All right, so we have the walk-in closet, hallway, lockbox, and mega mirror. Wow, do I know anybody who likes mega mirrors? They look good, they look good. I feel like a soccer mom right now. Soccer mom. All right, let's go. Let's keep going before I get. Wow, I, I've been to a few soccer games. You weren't one of the moms. All right, so you have a massive sink, massive bathroom, and if it gets stinky, you can close it and lock them in there so they can smell. Them it. or whoever, whoever you want. Massive bathtub. This is crazy big. Wait, get in. Wait. Oh, it's wet. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> I fall in the thing. It can't get up. Where's your can't get up button? <laughs> My butt is wet. Okay, guys, it's the water in there. There's just a little, little, little bit. And then you have the voyeur window. Oh my gosh, and? Shower. But look. Holy, this is. This is, oh, and it goes in a little bit. And it slopes so that the water doesn't pool against you. And look how relaxed, oh my gosh. This is such a good idea. If we build a house, this is coming in. A little longer than your feet, Does one foot foot there and one foot foot there while you sit? Why would you want that? No. Weirdo. What are you talking about? Weirdo. Why am I weird? Anyways, and then you can watch TV as well. All right, and wow, it's like half down right now, the privacy thing. Hang on. Are you going to put on a show tonight? Yeah. That's not the show I was expecting. Like another mirror? Are you kidding me? Okay, come it's finish so your tour. Big. Okay, all right, we're still going. This is what? This Look is to your massive. right. My right. Another mirror? Whoa, oh, oh, plus over there. Everywhere. Yeah. Look at the bed. Oh my gosh. This is like the size of an apartment already. Like just this bedroom. Yeah. And then it has so much other stuff. Yeah. Well, let's see. Oh my gosh. There's a full on living room. Oh, this is like good for families and everything. And me. <laughs> <laughs> and me alone. Oh, this you is could nice. live in this. I could live in this. I would easily live in this. All right. I know con. I know condos aren't my thing, but this is this would be worth it. Yeah, a condo like this would, would be a fortune. Maybe just like 
like 24 million pesos like something I don't, like that you know, yeah just, just something like that and as you can see you got more of mega world down here oh the convention hall yep a bunch of the buildings you could see k-town where all those facade built kind of facades but like not i don't know i don't know but you could see more buildings can going see the up. ocean you can see garamus oh my gosh you can see garamus that's amazing it's that pretty incredible like see the mountains over in the distance over there yeah this is really really incredible wow, all right four, baby. there is one rule that you must follow and that is if you come to a hotel as swanky as this you have to try the bed yes. you have to do a bed test you got to do the bed test all right are you ready the sun's starting to come down and that means Pool time. time to go to the pool. Doors are open. We have a gym here as well. Yeah, we'll have to show it off later. It looks pretty fancy. All right, let's go see this. I feel pretty fancy. A house robe and some heeled sandals. I feel like I... Wait till they see what's under the robe, though. <laughs> a brand new bathing suit. It is, it is. I need a bathing suit fund because all my bathing suits are getting gross. Excuse me, how many bathing suits have you bought? Like three. No, a three this week. Three, no, 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 Probably no. Probably this Hello. week. Hello, everybody. Oh my gosh, look at the pool is popping. Wow. And yeah, look at that. They do massages up there. I wonder if we should do that. Uh, you want to? Cool. Yeah? Cool. Yeah? Yeah, it's, it's perfect time because the sun is finally starting to come down and everything. So. <laughs> Showering with a view. Look at that. It's like your little tropical paradise over here. Good. Wow, the water is it's so warm. warm. It's yeah, it's beautiful. This and is like the perfect time to go swimming. It really is. Honestly, it's like the sunset time is the most beautiful. And so, yeah, we did decide that we're going to do the massage up there during the sunset. I, the weather is perfect for it. I know. Yeah. It's not hot at all. Oh, no. We were lucky we picked yeah, today. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, two days ago, no. And this is a long weekend here in the Philippines. Yes, it's this is Labor Day. Yeah, Labor it's Day. Labor Day weekend. Do you feel like you're unlabored? I, I, it is a good holiday for me. I was going to say, you're, you're relaxing in a pool right now. So. And I'm being carried. With one arm. With one arm. Look how strong I am. Ooh. Underwater. Anyway, this is a lot of fun. I like this place so much. This is a beautiful view. I'm, we're looking forward to tonight. Oh my goodness. Yeah, especially with the lights and yeah. everything. It's going to be exciting. It's going to be And good. we have to try their food. Get ready, get ready for that, okay? Be ready. Because I'm sure if the desserts or anything could go off of, you know the food is going to look banging and probably taste banging as well. Honestly, <laughs> though, I think this is one of the best hotels we've stayed in in a very long time. Yeah, this the is room has been fun. amazing. This has been wonderful. So now let's go and enjoy a little bit more of this. <laughs> Time? I think so. I think this spot would be perfect. Yeah, and you know what? The weather is absolutely perfect for it. So I'm down. I'm down. All right. Look at this setup. Now they have this as a permanent service that's available here, and uh, you can book it when you stay at the hotel. It looks great, though. Oh my gosh. There you go. Just press zero, it says. Touch of Moroccan Spa and Salon. All right. Beautiful sunset view right over the mountains. This is going to be beautiful. Hello, by the way. Hello, ladies. Hello. 
I'm Michael and this is Bianca. Hi, I'm Bianca. Nice to meet you. All right. Oh, look at this. I know. This is fantastic. Check out my robe here. Look at mine. Wow, I look like I should be on a, a stage in Vegas. You should. I know, I know. I, like, I, feel, I feel like I have wings. I can fly. Like a little wizard. I think I am like a little wizard. So, young lady, I know how my massage was. How was mine your massage? Mine was fantastic. I fell asleep a couple times, which is very rare for me. And it's crazy because there are kids swimming. Yeah. You can, you can yeah, get the massage. Lots of people. Yeah, you can get the massage up in your room. Oh, okay. But I still fell asleep. Yeah. I'm pretty sure there was a kid uh, crying at one point and yeah. I just, it was You just down. blank out. Zoned yeah. Out. You totally so blank out. That's how good it was. Yeah. That's how good it was, okay? But you're not lying. You don't even notice. You don't even notice. You just like. Yeah, it was very relaxing. Now, of course, you want the hard massages, stuff like that, where you're in extreme pain and you enjoy that. I'm moderate. You can I'm have that. I got, I got light. I was like, nah. I still fell asleep. I wanted so, to sleep. I like a little bit of pain. Yeah. All right, it's time to. Yeah. So these donuts are a little bit special. Uh, if you couldn't tell from the ice cream, this one has bunty which is the topping and it's a local delicacy here in Iloilo and the next one with the like strawberry ice cream it has has a white champarado champarado so you know champarado right well they did a twist on that and made it white chocolate instead so we're gonna dig in I'm excited I've never met champarado is he a nice guy or it's a it's a <laughs> I don't know how to explain it. It's well, you asked like, me if I knew him. I don't know. Okay, well, if everybody else, if you know Chomperado, you yeah, know. <laughs> you just know. You, you know. know. All right, let's give it a shot. The ice cream is good. Okay, let me actually dig in properly. Yeah. I don't know. Should I just stab in? Do it. Why not? I don't think it'll come. I don't know how to eat oh, a donut. Look, you don't, oh. you don't know how to eat a donut. With You're Canadian. Utensils. With uh, utensils. Fair, fair, fair. Well, eat it the Filipino way. I need to learn how to make this. It's like an old fashioned donut. Okay. And then it's obviously coated with the white chocolate and the champarado and the strawberry ice cream. Very nice. So put that all together and you have magic in your mouth. Magic in your mouth. All right, look at the size of this. I'm gonna put this all in my mouth though, sorry. Do it. No, you have to share. No, you have no. to share. Oh, it's crunchy on the outside. You got the ice cream, of course, but I'm sorry, but this has a cinnamon, beautiful taste to it. And it's got the hard shell candy on the outside. I gotta try this it next. This isn't a donut, this is a cake. This is a full on cake. Look at that. Yeah. It is full on cake. I'm eating cake right now. See? See what I mean? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. That one, that one hits. Nice. They're both really good though. You gotta try this one. What is one of the nicknames that you have? That are appropriate for YouTube? Yeah, yeah, perfect. Oh, okay. The Savannah Mule. <laughs> That's a new one, but I'll uh, take it. Take it, take it. You work like a mule some days, right? I do. I do you see this? <laughs> do you see this right now? This is hard work. Uh -huh. This is hard work. Alright, we're gonna try this one out. It's got like a ginger beer. Yeah, you know. It's got some uh alcohol in it, of course. Dark rum, right? Dark rum, that's right. I love it. Oh my gosh. I'm more okay, when I it comes to alcohol for me, I prefer like Less sweet, right? You no, know, less sugary. This is so nice. It feels very classy. You know? Oh, it was just you. Do you want to say hello? Yeah. 
Yeah, do you want to say hi to the vlog? Hello! <laughs> this is one of Inna's friends from uh, uh, the Perez family that we see all the time. Yeah. And of course, April's friend, yes. Thank you. are so pretty in person. Oh, thank you, thank you. Wow. You make me blush. <laughs> I think it's a smart casual. That's what they said. You have to wear smart casual here at the granary. Oh, whoa. You just got smart. Too smart. Uh. It's not smart casual, that's smart. Too smart. Formal. Oh, fair, fair, fair. But yeah, I'm excited. They're gonna start off with soup. What's this? It's a mango shape. It has bunny ears. It has a little bunny ears. So cute. Oh my goodness. And you can taste the mango in it. It's really good. Our first dish is bat choy, but it's not the typical one that you'd see in the market. It's got a bit of a twist. It's got some ramen noodles as well as nori. We got some pandesal here and chicharron as well. And so we're gonna dip the pandesal in into the bat choy. So yeah, the broth is 12 hours. 12 hour broth. Fantastic, okay. I'm not as fancy, okay guys? <laughs> I almost was a failure. Alright, I'm gonna do it. Oh. This is so flavorful and good. And with the pandesal as well, the pandesal is warm. And just dipping in it, it makes me feel so warm and cozy. You know, like a, a good home soup. This is so delicious. The food here is premium. And the meat they're putting in it is like really nice cuts of meat. That is very impressive. Let's just show you here. Look at this. Look at this. I heard there's some ricotta cheese made of carabao. Of carabao. No, of carabao milk. Well. What? what do we have here? This looks amazing. Yes, sir. Uh, this would be our gourmet to Uh It has a sourdough bread uh, with spicy gourmet toyo with homemade ricotta cheese uh, it means from caramel milk amazing yes it, it has also garnish of micro beans it has also cherry tomatoes on it with the sides of we have here some gourmet toyo and some mixed olives that would be black and green olives and some chilies in it Presentation alone is I just know. like, okay, I don't want to eat it now. Let me take a picture first. So. Okay, take a picture. Look at the sourdough bread, it's so thick. Oh. This is fantastic. Oh my God. It's like a mix of Greek salad in my mouth on top of bread. I don't think I've any. I've, I don't think I've ever had anything like this. But this is fantastic. Like the cheese, the tomatoes, the toya, even the olives—they all mix together, and like it's like fireworks going off in your mouth. All right, look at this 
beautiful, gorgeous fish, and I believe a mango salad or something. So let's find out. What is this fish? That would be our one of our meat-free special menu. It, uh, it is a inasal na pompano. It is a pompano fish. It has also mango salsa on it and crispy kangkong ribs. It is best paired with, of course, it is condiments, the na our native sauce. All right, excellent. It looks absolutely delicious. That'll be good to dig into. Right. And then over here, I this looks like a curry curry. I think I can see a little bit of lechon in here. Yeah. What else are we, uh, there's some prawns? We called it L3, or it is called uh, latik. It has latik, it is uh, squash puree with coconut milk. It has also sea prawns or lukon here in Iloilo. And lechon kawale is the fried pork in it. And of course you have to pair it with some steamed rice. Yes. All right, I hope you brought an appetite. This is gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Let's see how it tastes. Thank you so much. You gotta get some pork and shrimp in one. Mm. That's competing against my curry curry. Yeah, squash is delicious, let's be honest. That is an amazing mix of flavor. Deep it is, but it is really, really good. You literally, it was nothing good. That one was low. We'll have one little bite first. Oh! Whatever sauce they use for that, it's really good. It almost tastes like a barbecue sauce on fish. It's really, really good. Let's be honest. And she gave us two paper Everybody rings. loves Bianca. Aww. Thank you, Brielle. That was so adorable. Thank you so much. We can't end the night without a few drinks. Okay, that's just how it is. <laughs> that's, that's not just... very Bianca. <laughs> so here we are in the Biz Bar. It's right across from the granary, so after supper you can come and grab a drink, chill, yeah, and some tapas. Music right now. I know, this is beautiful. like wait 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 I gotta pick it up I'm pretty sure these are poppers is these poppers mm. they're not what I thought they were I thought you know just mozzarella cheese poppers no this is a creamy ranch type sauce in it and uh, can't figure out what the other hint of taste is, but it, it tastes really delicious if that helps. Almost like a spinachy sort of taste. They brought us some more bar food to try. There's some pork. Yes. Some, like, supreme. This looks like a, like a potato supreme, yeah. So not french fries, but actual little potatoes, like the minis. You know the mini potatoes? Oh my gosh. I hope you're hungry. Like really, really hungry. The good thing is, it's all very yummy. It is. So it's worth it. Every bite is worth it. Oh wow! It's very, very. It's like slow roasted or 
something. Amazing. Oh. This one sir is Mabuhay. Mabuhay. This is a uh, Mojito inspired cocktail. Bianca. Here you go, ma'am. Mabuhay. Mabuhay. Excuse me. Look at the mint on top. I can tell that right away. You got a little lime twist. It smells very, very good. Oh Cheers. my goodness. Cheers. You have to love it. That's it's Mabuhay. Nice. Come on. Mabuhai. Unless we have a Kamusta drink somewhere. That's the next one. <laughs> yeah. All right, how is it? These potatoes, they're not just, I don't know. What did they do to them? They're so good, right? Hot. What is in the middle of these, though? They're like a, like they're a puff? Yeah, they're like a puff thing loaded with something in it that is just, it tastes so good, but I can't. You can't describe it. And I can't figure out what's in the middle. Oh, look at that. So I think there's some like herbs and spices in here that make that taste, but it's so good. And with the cream, this is great. This is the Palamek. It is another sweet drink, but this one is also refreshing and an entirely different mix. They have a lot of signature drinks here and they're delicious. Good morning, Pajama Girl. Time for breakfast, I think. There's already people at the pool, of course. Summer yeah, how was how was your sleep by the way in that bed? Oh man, I wanted to say that bed. In the shower, in the bath. Everything. It felt off. It was a stay away from home. Yeah, exactly. Good morning. Okay, there's a line right now. It's a little busy. Everyone goes at 9:30. Yeah, we're, everybody goes at 9:30. Right because it closes at 10. Breakfast. So of course we wanted to stay in bed for as long as possible yeah. before we had to get up and go. Somebody was edited until uh, 3 o'clock in the morning. So. I was not. It was not me. No? It was not me. I, I just sleep. I wonder who it was. Mysteries. Mysteries no, about. No, I didn't. No, somebody cool, for sure. Hello again. Good morning. Oh, good morning. Good morning. Wow, look at this seat. We got our, we got our table back. As you can see, it is a busy breakfast day. I thought you, I thought you were in here. No idea what that is. We got lots of breads here. Cakes. What? Not a healthy breakfast. My goodness. Oatmeal. That looks good. Oh, wait. I can look now. I don't know. I'm not sure what that is. Well, we got bacon, but they're out right now. Pancakes, different types of rice, kung pao noodles, steamed butterfingers, the fish, sorry, lechon, milk, breakfast sausage. Hello. Boiled eggs, and then also you can have uh, omelets. It looks like omelet or hard boiled eggs, sunny side up, poached and scrambled. Not the uh, typical American breakfast. Well, yes, but much more than that, obviously. You have what looks to me like dinner and lunch and everything else. You have breakfast over here, or sorry, you have juice over here, coffee, cereal. You have mixed nuts and everything. Oh, you can have like a whole salad in the morning. Hi, good morning. That's Philippine Slide. Yeah. Good morning, sir. Yeah, you can have a whole salad in the morning. This is incredible. Isn't this wonderful uh, breakfast? Yeah. Yeah. All right. I wasn't expecting that. Like, you have a whole meal here. So, uh, if you feel like eating dinner at 10 in the morning or 9 in the morning, or I'm already. I'm out of it. What can I say? I'm out of it. Uh, they have it all here. So, yeah, eat up. Oh, this is why they have no bacon. 
I just saw a few people go by with me and the only thing they have on their plates is 100% bacon. But they're bringing out more. I just one in. Look at all that bacon. All right, so you didn't go for the bacon. I, there was a lot of people at the bacon. <laughs> yes, bacon. I saw people, the only thing on their plate and, with a mountain bacon, and we're talking small children. They're smart, they understand like the importance. They're not smart because that is not a balanced diet. No, it's fine. <laughs> it's, it's terrible. Fine. It's, but it's the most expensive thing, so True. go for it. True, fair enough. But um, I wanted to get a little mix, so I got some rice, I got some noodles, I got cheese, I got... I didn't I, see the cheese, that's pretty I incredible. I got cheese, I got fruit, and I got meat and fish. His breakfast came included for the two of us, so it's free. Well, my dear, it is time to go. I don't want to leave. I know, I know. I don't want to go. The bed, the bathroom, everything, absolutely amazing. Oh, come on now. We got to drag you out of bed. I'm here for it. Good. I'm here for good. <laughs> if you book this room, she may be here. That's all I can say. All right. So what is the price of this hotel? Of course, this is a Western Standard type hotel. It's really beautiful everything you can imagine in any other western standard hotel you know they're gonna have it or more and uh so yes the price is gonna be a little bit more but you're in the central location everything is beautiful and perfect here so it is five thousand pesos a night um uh, that's the starting range obviously there's big suites and stuff like that this is a bit bigger suite that kind of thing and uh so the prices will go up but so that's about what is that 80 no it's about 90. 90. Yeah, I think it's about 90 US dollars a night. Um, Which is not bad. No, it's not bad. Um, but if you're staying more than 15 days, uh, they do have a long-term discount. So 15 days or more, it goes down to 4,300. So now you're below $80 a night. Now you're really talking. Yeah. So yeah, what you're getting here is definitely worth it. Top the, tier. Top tier. Like, look at this. Like, you're right in the heart of everything because we learned our lesson when we came here and we stayed at places and we we're like oh it's only $60 a night or $65 a night yeah but you spend so much in cabs and grabs and everything else yeah. just to get places and our friends that stayed up in Santa Barbara they got a great deal but he's like oh my god there's nothing there's nothing here we have to take a cab and it takes us 20 minutes to get everywhere so there is a big benefit here and that's what really really sets yeah, this place that's apart where you save the money yeah, yeah. for sure and just to be able to walk over and there's restaurants everywhere and obviously they have good restaurants here but you're just close to everything here are you dancing first no dancing for me oh isn't that what they say dance like nobody's watching nobody is watching no nobody's watching you no. <laughs> <laughs> all right so it was a wonderful staycation for us but we must go home one night is all we get I don't want all right thank you very much for joining us guys hope you enjoyed yes we'll see you again soon farewell